Hi everyone, welcome to Cook Stacy Cook. Today we are making Mapo Tofu. Mapo Tofu is a classic Sichuan dish. It's a spicy and savory tofu dish that goes so well with rice. Let me show you how I make it. Start by cutting some green onion into small pieces. The green onion will not get much cooking, so wash them well before you cut them. That means 3 cloves of garlic. I'm using fern tofu today. This dish can be made with either fern or silken tofu. If you have never made this dish before, I recommend you start with fern tofu. Cut the tofu into cubes. Then prepare some cornstarch and water mixture. Use cold water and mix until there is no more clumps. Next, we need some Sichuan broad bean paste. This is the most important part of this dish. It gives this dish its signature taste. If you cannot find this Sichuan broad bean paste in your local grocery store, you can find them online. I'm also adding some paprika to enhance the flavor and add some color. You can also use chili flakes, but keep in mind the Sichuan broad bean paste is already spicy. For meat, I'm using ground beef. Ground beef is traditionally used for this dish. If you don't have ground beef tendy, ground pork works well too. Alright, we are ready to cook. Add some oil to a hot pan over medium high heat and stir fry the ground beef. Use a spatula to break up the larger pieces. Continue to stir fry until some of the pieces look slightly brown. Then add the minced garlic. Briefly stir fry the minced garlic. And then add the Sichuan broad bean paste. Continue to stir fry the Sichuan broad bean paste briefly. Then add the paprika powder. Keep stir frying until everything is mixed together. Then add some hot water. When the sauce starts to boil, you can add the tofu. Gently stir the tofu until they are all covered in sauce. Then cover the lid and let it come back to a boil. Once the sauce starts to boil, gently stir the tofu again. Lower the heat to medium low. Put the lid back on and let the tofu simmer for 4 to 5 minutes. When the tofu is done simmering, Turn the heat back up to medium high and bring the sauce back to a rolling boil. Then we can add the cornstarch and water mixture to thicken up the sauce. Mix up the mixture again and add a little bit at a time. Gently stir it into the sauce. You need to pay attention to the consistency of the sauce here. You want the sauce to be just thick enough to coat and hang on to the rice you pour it on. When the sauce reaches the right consistency, turn off the heat and add the green onion. Sometimes I also add a little bit of Sichuan peppercorn powder here. It is optional, but it will bring the flavor of this dish to another level. Gently mix the green onion and tofu together and we are done. Look at this tofu. It's spicy, savory, soft, and it goes so well with rice. I hope you like our video today. If you find this video useful, please share with your friends and family. Let me know how you like this video in the comments. Thank you for watching and see you next time.